Well, hello there, people of the internet, hello again. I'm Demi and welcome to part 36. If you are wondering why the hell I sound like I am extremely pissed off, I am extremely pissed off because this is the fucking fifth, sixth, seventh, I lost fucking count how many times I'm recording this. It is because there's one fucking annoying creature and that fucking fucks me over every goddamn time. It's a fire imp, it's in the uh, lava magma zone somewhere. It emerges from there from time to time. Every just just before my just before I saved. Um And it's fucking it is just the most ridiculously annoying thing in the entire world, and I want to kill it in the most gruesome way possible to make it suffer so much. Unfortunately it's not possible in Dwarf Forces, but still. If it was possible to kill someone as slowly as or as painfully as possible, I really, really, really would consider it. For that thing, because it is fucking 6th, 5th, 8th, 100th, I don't even know. Might, might have been the 20th time, I don't fucking know. How, who knows these days? I fucking lost count anyway. He has killed, I don't know how many of my guys, every time, and every time he has killed my most legendary guys, straight away, and it is just so stupid and so ridiculous that I can't even explain to you how pissed off I am. He emerges from the lava, from the magma area somewhere. I think I know where, if I can find it. Well, I don't know where, because the area where he emerges from, I just can't see where that is. What the fuck was that? It was a wheelbarrow. An abandoned wheelbarrow, great. Now we have to get, get go back to get that thing. Those are somewhere... Who the hell is that? Just forget about that fucking rock, you idiot! You need to get out! Where was it? Somewhere over here. Yeah, here it is, somewhere. Down, down here. I think it's from over here. They haven't spawned in yet. I think it's from up here, or at least down there or something. So that's where I saw them last time. We're gonna get, yeah, we've got so many messages of people gone getting anywhere because everything is forbidden. And that's good, because I don't want anyone outside. Because that fucking fire imp has killed my most experienced guys like over and over and over and over again. They just keep, he just has the timing so fucking perfectly right that exactly when the fire imp emerges, my, 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 my most experienced guys are where he emerges from. And they fucking kill it. And they just fucking kill those uh, guys every goddamn time. And I'm and I'm not just gonna say, oh well, okay. Then I just lost my ex well most experienced guy that I that I spent I don't know how many fucking years on getting. I'm j I just lost them in fucking one second by a puny thing. Yeah, yeah, that's okay, that's fine. I'm not gonna fucking say that. I'm gonna fucking wait for this prick. I'm gonna kill him dead. And what the fuck is that guy doing? You're gonna get killed with a fucking fire imp if you're not careful. Because here is where the areas meet, where they come from, and it's from over here somewhere. Possibly now? Now that I did, I don't know, because I've deleted I don't know how many episodes already. Like six or seven or something. Seventh tried and seventh thing I'm doing this. Can just collect clay for bin area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to stay in there. What, 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 what? Okay, someone, okay, someone is doing this, yeah. Someone is going to, hey, hello, hello, I told you to shift F, which means follow. You claiming craft over workshop. To be expected. Still not there. Giraffe, collecting some wood, yeah. Oh, someone's actually disappeared from the, the other screen. Alright, some woods. what do you need? You need some more woods. We got some more woods. Uh, oh, this time you're grabbing leather. Yeah, leather. Uh, 
Oh, gem. Yeah, there you go, gem. I'm fucking on the lookout for those assholes. Oh, where the hell are you going now? Oh, an uncut gem, okay. Still not done. Going, oh, where the hell are you going now? Across the dining room. Oh, metal bars? Yeah, metal bars. Hopefully lead, because I've got way too much of that stuff and I can't use it in anything. And still not done. A lot of stuff, uh, a lot of the animals are moving, or uh, others are moving out. Which is fine by me. Possibly now, this is the time where they don't actually show up. They only show up when there are guys to kill, and when I prevent them from killing my most experienced guys, they're not gonna fucking show up, possibly. You've grabbed a rock. You're still not fucking done. You're grabbing another rock. Somewhere, yeah, there you are. There we go. Now you started work on mysterious construction. Wow, you've grabbed... What have you grabbed? Like two logs of wood. You grabbed raw gem, uncut gem, leather, two rocks, and some metal bars. Okay, well, I'm interested to see in what you're going to make. Hopefully it's valuable. Well, everything is valuable that they make, but I'm just curious to see what it is this time. Because that's always different. Yeah, everyone's like, oh, we can't go there, we can't go there. Possibly now. I mean, I can fucking tell you. I can fucking tell you. This thing has killed my guys. I don't know how many times at this point. He's killed Zack Taylor fucking five times. He's killed uh, the JJ Milty fucking five times. Like, my, like, out of my 223 dwarves, he has selected... No, I'm just going to kill his most experienced Mason and one of his most experienced Miners. Because why the fuck not? And it's so bullshit. It's so fucking bullshit. Like, out of everyone, why the hell did you specifically want to kill my most experienced guys? That you need to kill. And now, now that I've actually saved everyone, because it's the first time I'm actually doing a burrow before anything happens. Because usually I'm doing a burrow. Literally, well, I didn't do a burrow before at all, actually. Um, I just... Um, I lost, like, fucking everything. And now I'm actually doing it. So now I'm gonna actually fucking record this and try to upload this. And now, nothing hap- no, now nothing's happening. So now you're all gonna think that I'm fucking crazy. Because nothing's going on, there's nothing here. And the second- You can fucking believe me. The second I actually send guys down there, the second that there are actually guys down there that those things can kill, then they're gonna suddenly emerge and they're gonna fucking kill everything. I can tell you, that's probably what's going to happen. So therefore, I'm not sending anyone down there. I'm actually wondering whether I can make the caves a forbidden zone. Because that's kind of what I want. This is the area that I will emerge from, from this cave over here. I can't see where how much further this is going, but last time I checked, these imps came from up here. Of course, the only the, the, the easiest thing to, to do is build a wall there, and then we should be fine. Actually, I'm just wondering whether I can make this. No, this is an, actually an activity zone. I can't actually specifically des designate an area where they cannot go. And, it, and wow, you made an earring out of all that? Out of all that? Yeah, the earring. It's, it's pretty expensive. On the item is an image of Sposs New Talk, the god of monkeys. Oh, monk. Yeah, monkeys, yeah. The forgotten beast and dwarves in one humped, one humped camel leather. He's massacring the dwarf. The other relates to the rout of the armor of stability of the violent helms and the destruction of Blun Blunton Hall by the forgotten beast. Oh, it's actually not a god, it's just a beast, okay? In the midspring of one. Wow, in one? That's a very long time ago. 
doing the rampage of the forgotten beast okay yeah that's a long time ago because currently it is 201 so that is exactly 200 years ago that event okay interesting well, these fire amps are fucking doing fuck all. They, they, I bet they're sitting down there in the cave, raising their middle fingers against me. Like, fuck you, we're not going to go down there unless we can't kill your best guy. Alright, I'm actually going to save here. And restart the game. If those fire amps, when I send guys down there, immediately emerge and kill stuff, I'm going to fucking break my desk in half. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna release the the alert thingy. Oh god! Please don't crash. I'm seeing a loading icon on my mouse. It's usually a bad sign. Please don't crash on me. I know I said this last time when I was filming while saving. But what I'm gonna do once the game decides to stop crashing? Oh, there we go. There we go. Good. Okay, so we saved this. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to release the release the borrow immediately. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually going to go down here. Where is it? Um, further? No, no, it's further up. Further up. It's up here somewhere. What the fuck? There's still a guy down there. It's a good thing those fire aims didn't emerge because otherwise he would be dead already. Okay, so build, construction. No, 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 no. Construction, wall. There? Out of granite because that's the closest. No, I can't. Okay. Hopefully they will be able to get. Yes, yes, they will be able to get there because the fire aims got there, so. Should, they should be able to get there as well. Of course, they're not going to do it. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is go to alerts inactive. So everyone can go wherever they want. Right, if we, hopefully I can see someone that says... Check metal strands, what? Okay. Prepare easy meal. I hope for someone says constructing building. So otherwise this is not working. Because then the thing is gonna come out and it's gonna kill everyone probably. Drink. Pick up equipment, store item in stockpile. Uh, it doesn't say anything about constructing a building. It's leads and blah. It leads out that I've seen. That's the most annoying thing of the dwarves. When you tell them to do something and they're just like, no, nah, we're not going to do that. So, just to make sure, I'm going to move my soldiers down there. What the hell was that? Is that a dwarf? Oh, it's a siege engineer, yeah. Was even a siege engineer down there as well? Pfft. Okay. I'm fairly sure that this area, like this, is where those... Uh, fire imps came from. And the only way to access that area, or the only way for that area to join up with the stairway area, is there. So if I block this, it should stop anyone from doing from getting in there. Everyone's of course doing this. Sorry, I'm stuck pile. Pick up equipment, collect clay, store item in stockpile, store item in stockpile. No one is fucking constructing the building that I want to be constructed urgently. Great, just when I need it. Right, also I need to up the wheelbarrow to three, the limits, so that they will actually start using the bloody wheelbarrows. Up, 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 A lot of activity in this area now. Okay, my soldiers are here. 
The soldiers are here. There we go. Someone is constructing the wall. <laughs> oh, there we go. The wall's been constructed. Good. So, in theory, no one should be able... None of the fire imps should be able to get there. So, you guys... Uh, cancel station. There we go. Okay. Well, everyone that's watching this video is probably gonna probably gonna declare me crazy, but there was a fire imp. There really was a fire imp that caused me so much havoc. Well, if they're still there, they can't get us here anymore. Now I kind of want to explore this area, but still. Yeah, you can't put a door in there either, because I read on the wiki, in one of my deleted episodes, that fire imps will actually just open forbidden, win forbidden doors. So, yeah, we can't really do anything about that. But anyway, that was that dealt with. You all, yeah, as I said, you're all going to think that I'm crazy because you saw nothing. You didn't see anything. Literally, you didn't see anything. Um, but there was a fire... You just have to trust me and, b and believe me that there, is actually, that there actually was a fucking fire imp down there. But yeah. Anyway, what I wanted to do for this episode is I wanted to build to... I actually wanted to expand my uh, defenses of my fortress. Which uh, I will do a little bit now, but most of the time has been in waiting for the fire imp that never came. But basically I'll build a bigger uh, barracks area for my soldiers to be in. And also I will... Um, of course, do the, uh, the 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 thing. Also, I need this uh, G finished good stockpile. I need to expand that here. Oh, there. All right, we do have some beds. Oh, we just need one more. Mr. Carpenter. Oh, crap. Not repeatedly. We just need one more bed. And then we're good. But yeah, I wanted to build the barracks. A new barracks. I guess I'll build it up here. So I'll remove... The archery range. Also, I've, I've figured out that you can use wooden bolts instead of bone ones. So I'll probably do that for training. And also, I've figured out that... Oh, Jesus. What the hell? Uh, Dr. Hedger was given the name to a stone, sh uh, stone shield. What the fuck? A wooden shield. That's good. Good thing that you're falling in love with your equipment. <laughs> Might sound weird, but that's the dwarven way, so don't worry. Uh, but, but what was I saying again? I'm saying something. I can't remember. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to build a new barracks, and um, yeah, it's going to be good. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember what I wanted to say. Uh, I also figured out that if you build, if you don't build your archery targets right be right next to a wall, which is what I have done, but if you don't do that, then and build a little trench behind it, you can actually collect the arrows instead of them wasting all their arrows, I think. I mean, that's what I've comprehended from the, uh, the tutorial that I watched. So hopefully that'll work. Also, we need to chop down some trees to get some wood. So I'll chop down these three. I'm going to chop down a huge load of trees, of course, because we need to still be uh, friends with the elves at the end of the year. Also, we need some fucking uh, coal for also our ceramic production. Mason needs to do that. This Mason is constructing a building. Which building are you going to? Oh, you're going to place a bed down. Okay. Has the final bed been made? Yes, it has. I told him only to build one bed. Ah, oh, whatever. It doesn't matter. He's done now. Holy shit, look at all those thirsty dwarves. Like, oh god, we need some we need fucking water right now. Nope, the fucking the fire imps don't want to show themselves for the camera anymore. 
I haven't deleted the clips entirely yet. So I might just go into my trash can and just show you really quickly edit all the, the times that they fucking killed everything. Oh, the well's dry. Oh, great. Now we also have that problem. Um, Alright, so we need to remove this zone. X. Shift X. Then we need to go up here. We need to go I. And we go... There. This is going to be your water source. Then we need to go down here again. And then we need to... Uh, remove building. Also, what would be a... Um, oh, no, never mind. That one would actually work. I think, at least. Actually, let's take a look. Build um, a well, which is an L. Oh, we don't have a chain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need to deconstruct that thing, and then we'll actually... Uh, Just thinking of a way to get a better... I told you guys that the water area is outside now. I gave this the, uh, the water source thing. Oh, look at that. The farmer's busy at the farm outside. That's good. Um, but yeah, what the, Oh, yeah, I wanted to... Perhaps I have a better I, better way of getting uh, this well going for longer. The well's already pretty, pretty dry. Mace is deconstructing nothing. Okay, so what I'm thinking is because the water's pressurized, right? It can shoot up another layer. So what I can do is build a designate. I'll build a water tank here. Like this, because I'm not using this area anyway. There. Dig this out. Obviously, we need there. Uh, we need H, actually. We need channel digging here. Because we want this area to be connected with this area. And then... We dig it like this, and then we connect it to this. We The dwarves won't drown, because first of all, there's a huge room, and second of all... This is just a very tiny bit of water, so they won't actually drown when they do this. We do need to make sure that they actually can get back up. But we can just build a ramp or something like that in there. Because the water will just flow over the stairs, as you have seen with our thing there. Okay, other thing I want to try out is build a well. Can we build a well over a... No, we can't. That's unfortunate, because the reason why I have to deconstruct the well to refill it every time is because otherwise um, the water is going to shoot up through the well into basically the rest of the room. So we have to build a floor here first. And then we can shoot the water in, because the floor will stop all the water from coming in. Actually, hang on a minute. It's just to make sure that we actually did it properly. Yeah, okay. You can dig. There, miners. Start a name on the silver maze. Okay, good for you. Fire rims? Nah, they're just not going to fucking show up anymore. Kind of alright with that, but yeah. At the same time, fuck you guys. So we constructed a floor there, so that's good. That means that the water won't shoot up through the well. So now what we are going to do is we're going to dig up this area. 
is what I've designated. This is going to be completely filled with water later on. There's actually a puppy in there. Horrified. Why are you horrified? Oh yeah, because there's still bodies in the water. <laughs> yes, they're drinking that. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. I can understand that you're a bit. You're like, nah. I prefer my own. I prefer my own well. Speaking of well, I also still need to make a fucking soap makers workshop. I need to construct start constructing soap. But yeah, then again, there's also a lot, of, a lot of other things I need to do, like make ceramics, get my new uh, barracks, get my defensive works, get my library, get my blah 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 blah. So I guess that can wait a little bit. Yeah, the soap makers workshop is still something that I want to do. Possibly I'll do it in here once I've moved my barracks out. Ah, the archer targets have been removed. Good. And it is autumn now, so game is saving again. <coughs> so. Yeah, I guess that's most of the stuff is going to be uh, for the next episode because I don't really have a lot of other things. I don't really have a lot of more time to do this for the next time. And for this episode, I mean. So I guess I'll do it for the next episode. Um. Okay, here we go. Uh, I'll end it off here. So I hope you almost enjoyed it. So click the like button underneath if you liked it. Subscribe to be part of Roman Army soon as in new videos. You can do that by clicking the subscribe button below the left of here or subscribe to the video. See you in a few moments. Ave.